Young world. So as I showed y'all earlier, the Dave Chappelle situation, everybody's seen it by now, I'm sure, but new information has come out. Now they're saying that Buster Rhymes was part of the security team that, hand, that handled the heckler that ran up on and beat him down. If you've seen the ambulance picture, the dude looked like his arm was bent backwards in half. But he didn't look like he was in that much pain. He was just sitting there. But his, his, his arm looked like it was totally bent backwards in half. But here's the thing about these people like this. This dude probably is in heaven right now. He probably loves the fact that he got whooped down by Busta Rhymes and members of Dave Chappelle's entourage. You got to understand the, the creepy mind state of these heckler type of dudes. It's real creepy and weird. I was at the uh, Kevin Hart um, show like, like, like a month or two ago. Came out here. I went... And there was a heckler there, and it was the, it was the first time I seen a heckler like up close and personal in real life. These jokers are weird, you know what I'm saying? Like their whole thing is to get attention for the heckle, like whether they get thrown out, people looking at them, like be happy to be pissing everybody off because you loud and stuff like that. These are some weird, creepy people. These heckler type people. So this dude that got beat up by Buster Rhymes, Chris Rock. And Dave Chappelle security, like he's believe it, he like loves this. You know what I'm saying? Like. To him, this is like a huge accomplishment in this Joker's life. Like, this is like he made it at this point as a heckler.